Hello, my name is Rene. I'm doing all sorts of trip reports and in this week's video I'm going to show you how to get from here to here. Let's go! So you ended up on Gatwick Airport and want to know how to get to the center of London? Well, you came to the right place. From Gatwick Airport to the center of London, the train is the best option. It's cheap, it's fast and the most convenient way. There are two operators. Number one, Southern Railways. And number two, the Gatwick Express. The Gatwick Express is, as it says, an express service directly from Gatwick to London Victoria non-stop. Southern Railways on the other hand stops two times on the route. Travel time on the Gatwick Express is around 30 minutes and the Southern train will take 34 to 38 minutes. The Gatwick Express will cost you 18 pounds for a single ride and the Southern Railway ticket will cost you 12 pounds. So naturally Southern Railway is the better deal. But for the sake of this channel, I wanted to test yeah, out yeah. what's it like on the Gatwick yeah, Express you. and if those six pounds extra are worth it. And on the other hand, for what happened to us yeah. at Gatwick Airport, we wanted to leave the airport as fast as we could. If you haven't checked out this story, make sure to click this video in the info box. So what can I say? The train itself is clean, modern, silent and the Wi-Fi service is very great. Everything you can wish for on a train. But I think the Gatwick Express is a rip-off. A. It's not much faster than the Southern Railway and it's not better or more comfortable. So these extra six pounds are absolutely not justified. And B. What I think is the biggest rip-off. The first class. Have you seen the first class coach as we entered the train? Can you spot a difference between first class and second class? I can't. But a first class ticket will cost you 27 pounds. So, for what? Or is there something that I'm missing? Pl if so, please tell me in the comments. Please. If not, that would be the worst first class on a train in Europe. Anyway. Enough with the nagging. As I said, the train ride itself is smooth, the conductor was very very friendly, the Wi-Fi was good, which I needed really really bad in this situation. And yeah, 30 minutes later we arrived at London Victoria station. So what can we learn from this experience? Avoid the Gatwick Express. The only reason for the Gatwick Express is that there are less people on board. So if you had a really stressful journey to Gatwick, I can see why those extra six pounds can be worth it. There are ticket machines at the airport, but I will leave a link in the description to buy direct tickets from Southern Railway. That's always the best option. And if you really want to, I will also drop a link to Gatwick Express, but that's on you. I want you. But you know what would be great right now? If you would like this video and subscribe to my channel, it would mean the world to me. So here we are in the heart of London at London Victoria Station. I hope my video was somehow helpful to you or even interesting. Stay safe, stay healthy, I hope to see you guys in the next video, bye bye.